Hello, this is going to be a review for the Audio Evolution Mobile, an app for Android devices that you can install on your smartphone and your tablet. So right from the start, when you open the free app, tells you that this is uh, indeed uh, just an evaluation app that you are yet you can try or you can buy they explain that uh, there are limitations loading of projects limited to three tracks mix down limited to 45 seconds recording um, and playback stops after two minutes uh, and the trial will expire after a while very funny because nobody knows exactly when it will expire, it might be one hour, it might be even forever, but it will expire. So let's choose try. Okay, it gives us this window with a mix picture, speaker and headset, USB audio device. I suppose they have some link to where you can buy audio device, and uh, you can also select the USB MIDI device which is a great thing let's delve into the app first knob you have the options to import audio MIDI files songs from your music database loops uh, create new project um, load project save everything normal here clean project delete it mix down project which is very useful for you to mix down your um, tracks export to other digital audio workstations which means you can render your tracks and open them in another software especially important when you are used to um, record and um, mix in your computer desktop you can always I like this uh, uh, this option export MIDI file because it allows you to uh, in um, to work on a project and if you don't need those specific uh, um, sounds you can export it as a MIDI file open it in your uh, home studio and uh, keep working from there very good option included on this app now let's see we have this scroll button which apparently does not can not do now because we don't have nothing in in this screen let's add a track let's add an audio track how many tracks you want to add okay let's go with just one oh there we have we can mute the track we can solo we can enable it to uh, be the track that it is going to record volume here okay we have a set of options in the bottom uh, we just press here and we can use the pen knob here we can do a <clears throat> quick setup of the equalization we, we have high mid uh, and lows we can we have an insert let's see what it can give us we have band pass chorus compressor delay distortion and you, when you see the the dollar sign it means that you have to pay to have it so it's not uh, uh, right from the beginning dual delay flanger graphic eq high pass very useful low pass to noise gate for drive paramedic we have a lot of tune boosters which is a dedicated plugin creator apparently you can buy their plugins and get them here too recall remover we have a lot of things here let's just add a band pass it's done as you can see you can choose the frequency all right let's close this uh, let's add another track now. Let's add a um, MIDI track. 
oh it tells you that you have to install additional content you need, you need to install sound font sf2 which it would be so good if it was already installed and you did, you could just start to create if you did not need to go online to download extra stuff very useful if they had done this step already so it's not uh, um, just start creating from the start because this step was not completed from their part let's add another track a uh, jump project track which also needs the sound found jesus these guys were sleeping they could have just simply add an extra sound so you can start creating some music immediately okay let's add just another um, audio track okay let's arm the track let's see if you can record apparently it's not recording anything which is a shame okay range uh, it's for you to uh, select the range you want to edit so you have your tracks on the left and you can select the range you want to edit remove to remove stuff you have on your main screen has these useful um, two knobs here two buttons where you can undo and redo whatever you are doing let's see what the more button has you can cut very useful to delete stuff uh, you can create loop as you can see here you have the loop, loop selection which will keep repeating until you no longer needs it the grid let's display the grid there you have beautiful grid uh, what do we have markers markers very useful yes okay it open the main screen just let's put it marker one you can add markers on the top of um, the measure so you can locate the um, your music uh, faster tempo which will open uh, the bars and the speed let's just change this to 100 sorry 130 just for this tutorial purpose let's see it is done what more do we have here options oh it will open your preferences hmm, I'm pairing up oh does not open and does not work when you are doing extra stuff on the back references it cannot do now okay the next button will show you I think they are trying to do um, like uh, the mixer pane where you will have all your um, mix or all your channels as a mixer the next button will show you your master bus where you can control uh, the volume and probably add some effects I'm not seeing uh, option for that now let me see you have the equalization here and yes you have the uh, you can add effects on the master bus yes it's all regular here okay we, we're back on the main screen um, let's just uh, try to see the options um, latency which is something that you will do right from the beginning to avoid have lag on your app um, preferences there you go touch range show title bar available devices at startup file manager very important so you can uh, choose the place where you are going to uh, save your music your exports your MIDI files yes volume slider useful too uh, audio input useful so you can select uh, where you are recording from 
can be as you can see an, an uh, extra microphone or your camcorder microphone a Bluetooth device very useful this what more do we have here software monitoring storage buffer size automatic master volume reductions uh, this can be or not useful depending how you are recording your signal uh, that's it for this review uh, I think this is a great app I would love it if they have packed it with sounds right from the beginning because if you are not if you don't have sounds if you don't have uh, kit drums to start creating um, a loop a drum loop it's a bit annoying it's the last thing that you want is to download an app and have to um, go online and uh, keep download downloading extra stuff um, the rest I like the app it's um, for, for my I think it's beautiful from my perspective um, I like the skin colors very very nice and um, and that's it thank you very much for watching please subscribe hit the like button thank you